Hello, today we're going to be looking at some of the features of the UDC Pro software. Today we're going to focus on the comparison feature in particular. I have modified the map right here that I'm showing you to be fairly obvious that it's not stock by any means, uh, just to kind of illustrate the differences when I actually go to compare a file. You'll see most of the cells in this table are pretty close to the same. So you can either use the button I just highlighted there or go up to file and then compare with file. And you can actually pick in this particular example anywhere from 10 through 16. You can do different files unlike most of the programs out there. So this is a manual file for the same year. You could do a 2010 auto, 2011 auto instead of the uh, 2015 like we're doing currently. Uh, the overlay is a pretty cool feature. You'll see that the kind of magenta pinkish there is going to be showing you what the changes from the map you're on is. So the blue is what the map is currently. The magenta is going to be what the changes actually are. Uh, we can remove the comparison just as easily and show you what you have been working on. So it's a really good way to use it as a reference point, more or less. So The other feature I'd like to demonstrate is the copy and paste functions. You can select a particular group of cells and actually copy it to anywhere you want, really. So in this case, I'm taking this group of 900. I'm going to go to the second or the first operating mode and paste it in the same place. You'll see that this graph here is going to raise up a little bit and has those highlighted. You'll see that there's a bump in that otherwise pretty flat graph there. Now you can also paste it in a different location in the table if you wish. So notice this is going to be slightly different than where we were before. Now I've tried to paste it somewhere where it's going to go off the graph and I'll show you right here. It's actually going to throw an error and say hey some of these are going to be out of bounds. So keep that in mind when you are pasting. It is going to still do the paste but it will cut off whatever it can't fit more or less. Last thing I'd like to show you is the ability to switch the axis on the graph. Not a huge feature by any means, but it does let you do it. You can swap back and forth on a whim. Uh, one thing I really wanted to nail down and have you know is you can compare files between different years of trucks, auto versus manual, whole nine yards. Uh, thanks for watching, and we will be putting out more videos soon.